<clears throat> so, uh, the son of uh, Elohim, uh, Yeshua, he said very clearly, no sign will be given to this wicked and adulterous generation except for the sign of Jonah. I shaved my stash because it was getting long. It's going to grow back. I'm growing it back. I'm not keeping this look. Anyhow, I digress. Uh, so, <clears throat> like I was saying, the sign of Jonah. Now, yes, Jonah told the people to repent. And the Ninevites, the people that he told to repent, they repented. And so God did not destroy them because they repented. And, but it's been 2,000 years since Paul the Apostle said, approximately 2,000 years, since Paul the Apostle said that God commands everyone everywhere to repent. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. So this message has been going around for 2,000 years, and Jonah preached repentance. They repented right away. It didn't, you know, take like a few weeks to settle in or anything like that. He told them to repent, and they repented right away, right there. It's been 2,000 years since the Lord told Paul to tell the people in Greece, and um, this message is for everyone everywhere, and that is to repent, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. So, basically, the wrath and destruction that's coming upon the people on planet Earth, and one of the angels says, whoa, whoa, whoa. Three woes. That's, that's not good. One woe is not good. Two woes is really bad. Three woes is like, I don't even know how to describe that. But if we read carefully through the book of Revelation, it just goes from bad to worse. And when it doesn't seem like it can get any worse, it does. And this is for the people that are stuck here on earth during the tribulation because they were not taken during the rapture because they didn't repent and turn to the Lord. Um, within the uh, parameters, guidelines of what is described as the Church of Philadelphia, these are the ones that uh, are making the rapture. They are like the five wise virgins with their lamps trimmed, filled with oil, burning bright ready for the rapture, loving the appearing of the Son of God. So that these people that are not going to be received by the rapture, these people are going to be here for the tribulation and the mark of the beast and all that stuff. Anyway, that's enough for now, and we will talk to you soon.